What's up YouTube, it's Jeffrey again. Today we're doing part three of the Sonic the Hedgehog bendable action figures by Jack Specific. And today we are reviewing Knuckles the Echidna. Now I already reviewed Sonic and Shadow, so this is Knuckles, and he comes with the Tails disc. So, let's get to the toy, shall we? Anyways, Knuckles here, he basically He's basically got the same box as Sonic Shadow and Tails, who I don't have yet, which I'll be sure to get Tails soon. Like I said, that's the render for the 25th anniversary. I don't know why they did that. Of course, there's a it shows Knuckles in all of his awesome glory. And on the back, it's just basically the same for all the characters, and yeah, so, all in boxes, guys, so. BRB. Okay, so now that I got Knuckles out of the box, let's go and review him. Now, he's got, you know, he's red. He's got the uh, more slightly darker but still tan muzzle. He's got that smile, just like Sonic or Tails would. He's got these, um, I'm not sure how to describe the color of his irises. I think they're purple or blue. But then again, they could just be a violet purple. I, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'll look at the X code for it so I can find out what color it is. Anyways, back to Knuckles. He's got those red dreadlocks, and surprisingly, because this is a bendable figure, this Knuckles, unlike most Knuckles toys of action figures that have their dreadlock dreads like solid feeling, like in our more hard to maneuver. This this knuckles here, that's a different story because because I mean oh this guy's made of rubbery plastic. He can actually you can actually get his arms to you know be like like that like get back here bro like he's got the uh, crescent moon on his uh yeah he's got that crescent like moon that half moon shape shape on his chest of course i noticed that in height scale in comparison knuckles has been slightly taller than sonic now so that's a bit interesting he's got the back threads this one's more solid than all the others so yeah this one's easier to control He's got the, uh, that tail, the echidna tail. Surprisingly, this part is able to flex. For some reason, he has that prominent neck thing that Shadow had. Like, basically Shadow had a slightly taller neck, so that could be the case. I could understand it's probably just to help Knuckles out on our unpoisability with the head. And again, some things are just mysteries. Anyways, he's got those spiky fists of, you know, he's got spike, the spiky knuckles, like, hence his name. Because, because unlike Sonic, he don't chuckle. He'd rather flex his muscles. Speaking of flex, you can flex his arm like that. Or even like this, I'll, I'll even do this, like, look at me, I'm tough. <sighs> Sorry about that, I just had to add some more life to Knuckles. He also has that bendable legs, like Sonic and Shadow. Like, and because of, of this, Knuckles can stand on his own. Why? Because of those big ass shoes. Like, Knuckles has some huge shoes, man! Like, look at that. Like... Is it me or do echidnas have big feet? Anyways, we've had an overview of Knuckles. Now let's get to the Tails disc. Now, just like the Sonic disc that came with the Shadow and the Knuckles disc that came with Sonic that I reviewed, I reviewed both those, 
the Tails London has the sprite of Tails from a Sonic Battle or Sonic Advance. So yeah, you can, you can roll it. I'll just um, do that. Oops, I, I can't do rolling. I'll just I, that kind of works. Anyways, yeah, I've had enough rolling him. I'm gonna um unfold him to show you what he looks like. Like. I think this might be his tails or his um, head. I'll just okay. So yeah, this is the body. Let's get the body out of the way for a moment. Get his tails out. How do you get his tails out? Does this one not have tails? Oh wait, there they are. I, they're just inside him. So I'm just gonna hang on a moment. BRB. There we go. Okay, got it. Yeah, there's his tails. He's got his tails showing up. I don't know why he's looking down there like that. Then again, it could just be because of the tails. And, and there you go. There's your little tails. Spin our fake for like I don't know what to do with this. I might just use this in maybe a, bo a board game. Like said, for the Sonic and Shadow figures, you can find them at Amazon or Target for ten dollars, or anywhere, including eBay. But just be careful because prices can skyrocket out of control. Anyways, enough talk about that. I'm gonna show you a comparison on two other strong characters. Okay, so now for a height comparison, here he is compared to the Diapet James that I reviewed and the Guardians of Harmony Applejack. So, yeah, I just basically pulled James and Applejack off the shelf just to show you on because these three are pretty strong characters. Anyways. I hope you like this review, and what review should I do next? This is Jeffrey Samburski, and I am out.